Chapter 12 Human Body, Health and Hygiene Science Word Pile Let us first study meanings of some important words in this chapter. Limbs Arms and Legs Respond This means to answer or to give a reply. Organs Body part of an organism. Environment The living and non-living conditions found in an area. Yelling Shouting Milk teeth a set of temporary teeth in young children. Human body, health and hygiene. Our body is made in such a way that no machine in the world can do so many things at the same time. Our body works day and night. It needs a lot of care and attention for working smoothly. Do you take care of your body? Now our body is made up of many parts as you can see from the picture. The head, shoulder, chest, Toe, which together form the leg. Besides these, there are also many parts inside our body, such as the heart, lungs and the stomach. These different parts of the body are called organs of the body. Each organ has a different function to do. A body he has three main parts. Can you guess what they are? Hmm. They are the head, the trunk, and the limbs. Let's have a look at them one by one, shall we? Head. The head contains important organs like the eyes, ears, nose and mouth which help us to see, hear, smell and taste. 
but most important of all the head has the brain which controls and commands the body it is the brain which understands what we see hear feel taste and smell the brain also instructs different parts of our body to move or react to these things the prehistoric remains of man disclose that the first man had a smaller brain than today's man the weight has been put at about 1 kg it is said that man is more intelligent today because more of his brain is concentrated towards the front of the skull mhm mm after the age of 18 a person may lose more than 1000 brain cells a day they die and are not replaced not to worry there are 100 billion brain cells in the human brain can you imagine that trunk it is the middle part of the body it includes the chest and the belly it protects important organs of the body like lungs heart and liver limbs our arms and legs are commonly known as limbs we have two arms don't we they help us to catch things pick them up write play bathe or take care of ourselves the arms have different parts like hands fingers nails wrist and elbow we also have a pair of legs which help us to walk run kick dance skip etc the different parts of the legs are the thighs knees ankles feet and toes do you feel like dancing right now why not sense organs certain organs help us to sense or feel the things in our environment our eyes help us to see things around us our tongue helps us to taste different foods yummy our nose helps us to smell things our ears help us to hear different sounds and our skin helps us to feel different things by touch these organs are called sense organs eyes eyes are one of our most precious sense organs they help us to see the bright beautiful and colorful world around us our eyes help us to see and recognize our surroundings so aren't our eyes important it is therefore very important that we properly care for and protect our eyes from injuries and infections 
regular cleaning and proper eye care will ensure trouble free eyesight for years to come so don't worry just take care tongue the tongue helps us to speak and taste the food we eat the tongue can tell us if something is salty sweet sour or bitter you can see from the picture the different parts of the tongue which feel the different tastes the tongue should be cleaned daily ears our ears help us to hear all types of sounds some are pleasant sounds like music and some are unpleasant sounds like screeching yelling we can listen to instructions and follow them can't we while walking down the road whenever we hear the horn of a car or bus we can move to one side to let it pass if you don't move they'll honk again thus they help to save us from accidents while bathing wash the ears regularly but take care that no water goes inside the ears never put any sharp object into the ears sharp objects can damage the ear permanently so take care nose the nose helps us to breathe the fine hair inside the nose traps the dust particles in air and helps us to breathe clean air the nose also helps us to smell the things around us now how do you feel when you smell the pleasant scent of a flower you like it and are attracted by it pleasant smells coming from different types of food also attract us and we feel like eating them don't we on the other hand unpleasant smells coming from garbage or other dirty things make us to go away from them thus our nose is a very useful and sensitive organ when you have a cold and your nose gets blocked you cannot smell things properly always keep the nose clean by blowing gently never blow the nose too hard the blocked air can go to the ears and damage them use a clean handkerchief or towel to clean the nose skin the skin is the outer covering of our body our skin helps us to feel things by touch we can feel heat cold anything sharp or blunt rough or smooth with the help of our skin it also protects the organs inside our body the skin stops germs from entering the body a clean skin is a healthy skin so we need to take regular baths to remove all the dirt and germs from the skin 
Do you take your regular baths? Yes, me too. Our teeth. When you eat your food, what is the first thing you do? Hmm. Well, the first thing you do is to place the food inside your mouth. Is it not so? What do your teeth do to it? Well, your teeth help you to chew the food well, thus breaking it into smaller bits so that they may be digested easily. Chewing also makes the saliva flow into the mouth. The saliva mixes up with the food and the process of digestion begins. Your teeth also give shape to your face and they help you in speaking. Words cannot be clearly pronounced without them. Sets of teeth During your lifetime, you have two sets of teeth. You begin to cut your first set of teeth, which is the temporary set, when you are about, say, six months old. And by the time you are two years old, you have all your 20 milk teeth. Between the age of 6 and 12, your milk teeth are replaced by a permanent set of teeth. There are 28 teeth in this set. Four more teeth, called the wisdom teeth, come out between the ages of 12 and 21. Finally, Every adult has a set of 32 teeth. Functions of teeth Cutting teeth or incisors These are the four front teeth in each jaw, which you use for biting. They have sharp edges. Tearing teeth or canines. On either side of the cutting teeth is a pointed tooth used for grabbing and tearing food. Grinding teeth or premolars and molars. These are the double teeth and are at the back of your mouth. They have platforms on them so that the food can be ground finely. Can you feel all these teeth? Hmm, yes you can. Care of teeth Because our teeth are important, so we should take care of them properly. What we need to do is Brush your teeth twice a day. Once in the morning and again in the night. Make an up and down movement of the brush while brushing and not left and right. Will you remember that? Use a good toothpaste. Never use hard things like coal or ash as these tend to harm the enamel of the teeth. Avoid eating too many sweets and chocolates as they can cause tooth decay. Rub the gums with the fingers after brushing. Rubbing helps to improve blood circulation in the gums and helps to remove dirt from them. Rinse mouth carefully after eating anything. Visit a dentist after every six months. 